let's let's talk about Rivian. Uh, okay. You had a big post on X a couple days ago yesterday about Rivian Catalyst. So the six I the six Catalyst I mentioned. Yeah. So that was a, a couple of days ago, and yeah, I mean, I continue to be excited about this con company. Um, I was just, you, you know, the more I think about it, the more undervalued I feel like it is from my perspective, especially as AI and um, uh, anything in that sort of like autonomy world continues to get a higher and higher valuation. Rivian is not going up along with them. And uh, and basically everyone is sort of like missing uh, any capabilities from Rivian. So if they come out with their sort of um, AI and autonomy day in December, I think that could be an in incredible catalyst for the company. The fact that they have cash to sort of like last them for quite some time to give them time to ramp up uh, the R2 production could be another major catalyst. The R2 product itself looks fantastic. It, you know, like this is a great alternative to the Model Y. Uh, it looks uh, beefier and like a stronger, like more outdoorsy Model Y uh, uh, type of vehicle. Design language. You know, it's yeah. funny. Uh, the Verge coined it as... Um, solar punk instead of like tesla being cyberpunk 